to some cultural barrier breaking at its finest. The Somalian born supermodel is slowly but surely taking over the fashion world as we know it. Her name is Halima Aden, and she is featured in the annual Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition, the most prestigious swimsuit model position of our time. And she did it all in a burkini and a hijab. Halima Aden took part in the shoot without compromising her morals and values. She said she wants to send a message to her community and to the world that women of all different backgrounds, looks and upbringings can stand together and be celebrated. And if you want to see more, you can visit si.com forward slash swimsuit. The issue will hit newsstands on May the 8th. Now, if you yourself are a modest, modest dresser but still love to hit the beach or work out, I hope you've taken some inspiration from Halima and get yourself involved. But to give you even more inspo, I'm doing, joined by Hannah Weinberg. She is the creator and designer of Hannah Banner, a modest performance wear company. Hannah, thank you so much for joining us. And Natalie and Melissa, thank you ladies as well for Thanks being with us. Yeah. Now, Hannah, let's start with you. Now, when it comes to athletic wear... You know, most of the time it's just tights, shorts and singlet tops, mostly in tighter fabrics and, you know, a lot of women, modest dresses, are not comfortable wearing that. How do you see it? Yeah, so, um, first of all, thanks for having me here today. You're welcome. Thanks for coming. <laughs> uh, so, very often the religious women, they feel very restricted because normally what they have is just a bunch of layers. They have leggings, a shirt with another layer underneath it. And so what we offer is just a solution that you have one layer for everything that you're wearing. And it's just, you know, lighter fabric and it just solves that problem. And you obviously, you obviously saw a gap in the market and thought, I, I, you know, I've got to try and fix this. Have you seen an increase in religious women or conservative women working out now that they have the availability to wear more comfortable clothes? For sure, for sure. So um, there's been a huge increase. There, actually, there's a really famous woman by the name of Mary Forrest. She started running groups all around Israel um, with religious women who are now running all around the streets of Israel. It's amazing. And you also have Bidi Deutsch who won the Jerusalem marathon last yes. year for the Israeli woman. And was she wearing your clothes? Yes, she was. Oh, wow, <laughs> cool. And now uh, slowly you're seeing such a huge increase in the community of modest runners. Absolutely. Now, ladies, you're both wearing different styles of this brand. Melissa, yes. how does it make you feel getting around in this? Oh, well, it makes me feel great. Honestly, I love going to the beach and it's very hard when you go to the beach and you see all these people in bikinis and you kind of just want to fit in and feel cool and be trendy. And this finally gives me the sense that like hey I can go to the beach I could be protect like covered up protected from the sun and be trendy at the same time and that's really important to me